Greetings. What I'm about to demonstrate is a very rapid prototype of the browser automation portion of the contract uh, you had specified. So I'll launch it from Visual Studio. Uh, let's see. Here we go. So I have a uh, web browser form here, and uh, it's not very pretty or anything. It's a really rapid uh, prototype. Uh, along the top of the browser uh, address, I have some form elements on the left and some buttons on the right. Now the buttons, the form elements, the browser address element, these are all uh, unnecessary and totally just for the purpose of uh, demonstration right now in this video. Uh, they don't need to be there. They can all be represented in code, uh, code behind. Well, what happens here is, for example, I go to... And whatever tag I put here and the attribute I'm looking for, it'll display what's in the page. So, for example, if I put input, input, these are the inputs on the page. So, this one I happen to know is this uh, bar here. So, what I can do now that I have it, I can select it and I can say uh, whatever. And I have that input into the field. And then I can look at the form on the page and I can submit it, which is this one. And I can say submit, and so that page goes and does that. So now I'll return to this place here so I can demonstrate a login. And there we are. So I'll look for the input field I need. And it's log. Put this. Oops. Admin. There we go. And then I need the password. So I'll use a password field. Add in the password field and then I'll submit the form once I have located it. And there it is, submit. And we've logged in. And so that's the login, the browser automation portion. Uh, after that, it'll be a really simple job to upload these files uh, that you mentioned and uh, have them removed, have the log of that created, uh, output to a flat file or CSV or what have you. And so that's it. Thank you and I'll talk to you soon.